So Johnny, we're going to play a game of Guess Who. You'll get five clues to guess a player who has some form of connection to you. So you'll get five points for getting after the first clue, four after the second, three after the third, and so on. The first player is a retired midfielder. His nationality is Scottish. Oh, I'm supposed to guess now? You can. I think he was retired and midfielder in Scottish. Uh, Gavin Ray. So he started his professional career at Inverness. Retired midfielder, Barry Robson. Correct. Me and Barry sat beside each other in a change room, and honestly, it was, it was brilliant. I've never ever met anyone like him. He's just an absolute enigma. Brilliant guy, but he's uh, fantastic to work for. But again, he had that mentality as soon as he was on the football pitch, it was 100% or nothing. He tried to reintroduce the uh, Copas to the change room, and me and, and Will Ford used to sort him in half every time he bought a new pair in. Second player is still playing, so an active player. He's a winger, and he represents the Republic of Ireland. James McLean. Nope, on the right lines though. Currently plays for Sunderland. Currently plays for Sunderland? Here, ah, Aidan. Aidan McGeady, yes. Because yeah, you came on for him when you made your debut for the Republic of Ireland. Didn't, didn't even realise, now Aidan uh, no, was good. Caught him well with Aidan, he's a... Uh, I remember uh, when I came on trial at Celtic when I was younger, about 14, 15, and we trained up uh, the park, I can't remember, there was like a public park for Aiden. I remember Aiden training with us and he was right. I remember walking away and who was who. Absolutely unbelievable. Still to this day, when I see him training with the national team, he's frightening. So, third player is an active defender and his nationality is Scottish. Scott McKenna. He started his career with Queen's Park. That, uh, Came through the ranks there. The back to Robertson. Yep, Andy Robertson. Because he, after Dundee, when he was at Dundee United, he won the Scotland Young Player of the Year, the year you won goal of the season. That was the same year, same awards night. This is a retired forward whose nationality is Italian. Want me to move on? Yeah, yeah. Right. So he started his career with Lazio and also played for Napoli and Milan. AC Milan, yeah? Yes. Right, so I'll move on. He's most famous for his time at West Ham. Oh, De Canio. De Canio, because he also played for Celtic, but he shares a birthday with you. I do. Yep. I know. Both July boys. So this is a really tough one, this last one. All right. So he's, he's still an active player. Um, he's Brazilian. Marcelo. He started his career with Grêmio in his home country. Neymar, no? Neymar, right. So moving on to the third clue. He moved to Porto in 2006 and then bought by Sir Alex Ferguson for Manchester United. Anderson. Anderson. And can you guess what the link is? Neil Simpson's testimonial. You both played and you both scored in that. Oh, yeah. Do you remember the game well? Yeah, uh, no, no, I, I just remember it. Yeah, I remember the first I didn't know Anderson played me. Yeah. Nah, he scored as well. Um, so, what was it like? Did you get a chance to speak to Sir Alex? Because he was taking no, that team? No, no, I was just, it was still quite, they had quite a few players. I'd come off and was standing in the tunnel. Watch uh, me, Russell Anderson, Paul Scholes, and uh, you know, it was a testimony, it was quite friendly. You could still see he wanted to, he wasn't too happy when people were giving the ball away, and obviously, Paul Scholes was a top, top midfielder. And uh, I was, it was like starstruck, but I, I always enjoyed watching him. He was always one that I'd love, love to watch, even as a bit of a Liverpool fan. Paul Scholes, I always thought was brilliant, so it was, it was good playing us. 